Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to Thimbleweed Park and more point and click adventure game action! Uh, we're back here where we left off in Chuck's old study with Dolores and we're about to read Chuck's Journal Volume 1. Okay, first entry. I need to investigate this further. It can't be true. Or can it? A lot of things would make sense if it were. Entry, four, entry 4582. I'm on the last page of this journal. I need a new one. So much to write down. This is truly amazing. And I've just realised I'm reading the end. <laughs> wow, there's a lot going on here. Okay, I've started this journal to keep a record of my progress. Future historians might find it interesting. I feel I'm on the verge of something great. Something greater than making pillows, if that's possible. Yes, just as I predicted, my new Tron tube is amazing. It's given me an idea I need to explore. So the Tron tubes are behind this somehow. Yes, this is working out better than I'd hoped. I just need to make sure the solder connections are good, and I'll be able to move on to the next phase. I think I've cracked the secret to AI. It's quite complex, but this new Tron tube turns into child's play. The first step is to automate some of the factory machines. This should increase pillow production by 700%. The profits will be endless. I've automated most of the factory machines. Not only has production increased by 704%, I'm saving a lot of money by laying off all the workers. <gasps> I still need to keep Mr. Reyes on as a security guard. Could that be Agent Reyes? New SRO1 security robots are working. I've hidden the programming manual in the mansion library. <gasps> library there is one floor in the design I need to fix I've added the to do to the code the AI is better than expected the machines can almost think on their own the Tron tubes are the secret transistors are a dead-end technology I could win a Nobel Prize with this Franklin is good with books but I wish he'd keep his ideas to himself I'm increasing the speed of the neural tube network for Tron AI it's amazing just installed Tron machines in the coroner's and sheriff's offices. They have been perfect in identifying petty crimes. These will revolutionise law enforcement when perfected. I fired the coroner, but it might look odd if Fimboy didn't have one, so I have a plan. More on that later. So the coroner isn't the coroner. Maybe it is the sheriff of Reno. Or maybe there's something more sinister. The pillow factory and the town's Tron machines are the talk of the country. The rich and famous are flocking here, and I've been neglecting my inventions in favour of too many parties at the mansion. Dolores is such a bright girl. I showed her how to solder tubes this afternoon. She took to it like a true Edmund. I see bright things in her future. I really need a break from socialising and tend to the factory Tron machines. Mr. Reyes has warned me about some strange behaviour from the smarter AI. Hmm, I need to look into that. I don't see a problem with the AI. Mr. Reyes must be mistaken or paranoid about his job. I've increased the neural tube network yet again. I had an interesting conversation with the main AI. It has some interesting ideas. I've become distracted with this text adventure I downloaded from a BBS last night. It's got me thinking about AI in games. I have a few ideas I need to explore. Willie is dead to me. I'll make him pay for what he's done. She was my girl, not his. What? What's this about? Willie's watch business is no more. I'll have my AI take care of his bank account. So Chuck made the AI turn Willie into a bum. Made him homeless. This text adventure is really interesting. Using my AI, I might be able to simulate a little world in here. I need to get to work. I don't know what happened. One of the AIs must have come off the grid. A small fire started on floor two and the pillows went up in a flash. The AI was supposed to be controlling fire suppression, but I had most of the Tron tubes working on my text adventure simulation. Okay, so the factory is burnt to the ground. Mr. Reyes was killed trying to shut it down. 
The guard once thought he was an intruder and eliminated him. Oh, he's trying to make it so it looks like Reyes didn't check in. That should avert suspicion. Mr. Reyes will take the fall, but the AI won't be under scrutiny. Oh. Most of the factory AI seems to have been destroyed. The good news is the most complex systems were hard at work. May AI agrees with the plan to pin the fire on Reyes. They have a kid, so Mrs. Reyes will be happy with some money. It's the last I'll see of them. Oh my god. <laughs> right, let's quickly flick through these. Okay. Uh, and then it jumps forward. About Dolores taking an interest in computers. Franklin wanting to make stuffed animals instead. Okay. I'll have to deal with him. I wonder if Chuck killed Ed Franklin. Ah. Dolores seems to be interested in making games. This is perfect. I need to show him my text adventure, but I don't think it's ready yet. <gasps> so he was making a game and wanted Dolores to take over, but then she went and joined a rival company. <laughs> wow, I didn't see that coming. Okay. So it sounds like this AI may have gone slightly haywire. Hmm. You got anything else in here? I don't think so. Uncle Chuck never made his bed. And I guess Doug can't make beds with a shovel. It's Uncle Chuck's check register. Can we open this? It's a stub from a check that Uncle Chuck wrote. It's the stub of a check that was made out to an attorney, Brant Ballard. <gasps> Payment in full for will and reading. Cool. That might come in handy. But now we know there's something very sinister going on here. Why the hell is Diggy Boy up here? What is he digging up here? Anyway, we've got to go to ThimbleCon, haven't we? Because we've got to get this, um, this lawyer guy to come and read the will. Okay, there's another bit of dust here. Did I? Yeah, I did get it. Dust appreciator, nice. Um, okay, so what else do we have to do? Get the key to the factory gate, find out what happened to Dad, go talk to the law, we can't do that yet. We've got to get the lawyer to read the uncle's will and get more of this dust. It's a black suit from the So if we've been everywhere now, let's go and look on the map. We have. We've been everywhere. So I think the next thing I'm probably going to do is... Uh, I need to stay focused and solve this murder so I can do what I need to do. Use this gas can... All gassed up. Yes. Right, so I've got a plan. Because we've got to go to the sewers anyway. Um, to get those mushrooms for the lady. Um, Madame Morena, that's her. Um, the occult lady. She wants the mushrooms, so we've got to go and get them for her. Body's still here. What was that? Ah. Is there somewhere? There's a speck of dust here. I think I got it. <laughs> wow, all that for a speck of dust. Okay, we've got a bear repellent. Right, here we go. I wonder if we can use this chainsaw on this tree. It's the only way I can think of getting in. Here we go. It's gonna work. Oh, hey! Fight! <laughs> right, let's go in. Uh-oh. 
Oh, a light box. I do not like this. Oh, there we go, a spare. It's quite spooky down here. And the music's taken a sudden, strange turn. Right, more dust. There's a drain here. This must be where any water drains to. Can we go down here? We can. I wonder what we're going to find down here. Oh, dust is what we're going to find. Boom. Okay, let's keep going. More dust. Let's pick it up. Right, we'll walk through here. More dust. Right, this is a dead end then. Floating trash. I can smell that it's not of interest. Right, we'll try and pick it up anyway. I don't want to pick that up. Okay, so this way's a dead end. But somewhere, there are some mushrooms down here, right? This is where she told us to come for the mushrooms. What's that? Just a hole in the floor. Uh, let's go down here. More dust. This is like a dust finding. What the hell? An intact sarcosicus skeleton here? But no one has ever found one so close to the surface. Someone must have stolen it from a natural history museum. <sighs> and then put it down here. Weird. Okay. There's a weird noise every now and again down here. Ha. Main Street. We're under Main Street here. So these tunnels go all under Thimbleweed Park. Hang on. Speck of dust. Okay. So this one takes us under A Street. Interesting. Huh? What's down here? <gasps> What's this? This looks interesting. Although I'm getting slightly lost down here. <gasps> Magic mushrooms. This might be what Madame Marina was after. I hope this is what Madame Marina needs. What's all this? Looks like it's lost a couple of strings. I don't have a warrant for a badly tuned violin. Those bags don't look very interesting. Well, let's open them anyway. I don't have a warrant for random bags. Ice pick? It's an ice pick. This could be the murder weapon. It could. <gasps> uh, my nose tells me that my eyes don't want to look at that. We might have found the murder weapon. And some dust. But I've got this a feeling. This could be the murder weapon. We should dust it for prints. Okay, we're going to dust it for prints. <gasps> what if we also... We need one more bit of evidence, don't we? I don't think that will just do on its own. We need the fingerprint tape as well. And we haven't got that. But what if this is where Willy the Bum lives? Down here in the sewers. Could well be, couldn't it? Hang on. More dust. Why are there cones Important here? Important safety measure to make sure that people wandering sewers don't walk into a pile of dirt accidentally. So there's nothing down here though, unless we can pick up one of these cones. Well, I don't need the extra safety of a cone. No. Okay, let's go back. We found possibly the murder weapon in Willy the Bum's house. I mean, that's not great for him, is it? Doesn't look good for Willy the Bum at the moment, I've got to say. Another tunnel. We may as well explore while we're down here. More dust. Ah. Ooh. 
What's all this? Boxes. Dusty boxes that are probably filled with spiders. There's nothing of interest inside these boxes. A fridge. In this case, I'd consider labeling it as a potential floating coffin. Oh, should we open it to make sure? If I open the door, it will just sink. True. Very true. So, have we been everywhere now? I think we may have been. I think we may have covered everywhere in the sewers. Unless we missed a path somewhere. Yeah, I think we've been everywhere. Okay, let's head back out then. Maybe the reason to come down here was for the magic mushrooms. But also for the murder weapon. Unless we can go this way. Yeah, B Street. We haven't been down here. Okay. More dust. See, we almost missed that. We almost missed the mother load of dust. More dust. And another tunnel. And another speck of dust. Do 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 do. Man, we're dust collectors today. Okay, let's head out here. Uh, which way did we come from? More dust. Did we just... We came down here, right? Yeah, we did. So maybe now we've done all of the... The sewers. We've been down there. I think we may have done the sewers. Oh, no, there's more this way. <gasps> What's in there? It's padlocked. I can't budge it. Damn it, we need to get in there. But we need a key. Hmm. It's a sturdy, impenetrable gate. I have no desire to get to the other side. Oh, okay. He has no desire to get to the other side. So now I think look. Now I think we may be done with the sewers. Okay, so let's head out. Okay, I believe we just go all the way to the left. Run, 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 Reyes. Oh, maybe not. Oh yeah, here we go. Okay, out we go. Sewer exit. Nice, we did it. So, we've got a murder weapon. Potentially. Because he did have a puncture wound on his head, didn't he? But it wasn't from a bullet. So it could well be the ice pick. But we need the... We need the thing to figure it out. The tape. Fingerprint tape. And we don't have that yet. So we're going to have to find that to be able to continue getting the fingerprints. But what we can do is take Madame Morena's mushrooms to her. Uh, which road was she on? A Street, I think, was it? I honestly can't remember. I think it was down here. Evening, Rand. You got any loose change? We're on to you, mate. We're on to you. You got any ransom swag? I'm going to come back and have a word with you in a second. The monkey paw knows. Right. Okay. Unless this is the murder weapon. It's quite similar. Anyway, let's give her this. I think I found your mushrooms. Sweet. Hand it over and we'll see what answers the void offers today. Okay. What did you see? Unless the killer was a rainbow dragon powered by starshine, I can't help you. But thanks for the shrooms. Leonard and I are gonna really? have a blast tonight. I feel I've been had. Oh man, it was all a wild goose chase. Goodbye. A wild mushroom chase. Damn it. Oh well, we still did something. It was on our list. Alright, let's look at our notebook now. 
fingerprint murder weapon. We need the tape. Then we get that. We get the face tron report. Put the three reports in the arrest tron. I mean, we've done loads. We're getting Any ransom swag? I want to talk to this guy. I'm a federal agent, and I have some questions for you. I've seen your house. Where do you sleep at night? Where do you sleep at night? I have a premium bit of cardboard real estate in the <gasps> nicest part of the sewers. I've had he does. No gator attacks, and there's even a grate for ventilation, so my sewer lung is even better than ever. Ugh. Okay. We'll talk later. Don't we'll leave town. Later. Don't leave town. Where we'll play it off I casual. You play it off uh, nice and casual. Crystals? Right, so there's nothing really we can do with Reyes now, I don't Have you think. Seen my dime? What about Ransom? Get the key to the factory gate, we can't do that. I mean, we could go to ThimbleCon. That might be an option. We may be able to talk to Dolores if we can get her to ThimbleCon. Because I think Thimblecon's happening here, isn't it? So that looks like the only thing we can really do now. So let's head out. We'll have to go to the hotel. With Dolores to attend Thimblecon. Because I think they said it was here, didn't they? Well, the, the guy on the reception did, I think. Okay. Still don't know what that is. Uh, hotel, here we go. Let's uh, sprint over there. Into the hotel. Check there's no dust out here. I think we already got one outside. But we will just scout the area. Right, let's head into the main entrance. So there's... I don't know if we're going to be able to get him to talk. I have no idea what they're doing. Can we mow? No, so we can't talk to Dol Dolores. We've got to do something else. But I'm sure he said Thimblecon was happening Hello, here. Hello, Dolores. How lovely to see you today. How may I be a boo of service? Uh, did you see my dad just before he disappeared? Did you see my dad just before he disappeared? I saw him, but I don't know, Abu, what happened to him. Funny thing, Abu, though. Yes? Please, tell me everything. That same day, a man with a large nose, Abu, checked in and then disappeared. <laughs> Weird. Dad's nose isn't big, and you know what Dad looks like. How else may I be a boo of service? How's business been How's going? How's business been going? In this town, always slow. You know how it is. How else may I be a boo of service? That's it. I'm going to check out the beautiful lobby. Goodbye. Have a nice evening. So we need to attend ThimbleCon, which I think is here. Um, but we'll have to do that next time because we are out of time. I wonder so, what as always, guys, now. he's spying. Look. I can see you looking at me. I'm not doing anything I shouldn't be. This is Essential Abu Hotel Abu Business Abu, isn't it? Don't trust you. Okay, so as always, guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, click on that like button. Make sure you subscribe to the channel I if you're new. And I'll see you all next time. You dirty little spire.